Governor Tate Reeves issuing strict orders for some Mississippians he says are living in COVID-19 hotspots in the state. 16 WAPT's Ross Adams joins us live from downtown Jackson to tell us where these hotspots are and the restrictions people who live there will face, Ross. That's right. The governor says they're focusing on a region in East Mississippi where the virus is more active right now. Those counties at higher risk of transmission are Atala, Leak, Scott, Jasper, Neshoba, Newton, and Lauderdale counties. Lauderdale County, 45 people have died in that county more than any other county in the state. The governor signed a new executive order that requires people who live in those counties to wear face masks at outdoors events and to keep a six foot distance in public places. Also, businesses must screen employees every day and provide face coverings to any staff who have direct contact with customers. And of course, the state did reopen without following those White House guidelines. Dr. Anthony Fauci said today that states that reopen too soon run the risk of needless death and suffering. Here's how the governor responded when we asked him about that today. What I will tell you is that I listened to the advice of our public health experts. Uh, we had conversations with Dr. Burks, uh, the coronavirus task force leader, and there is a recognition that every state is different. Every state's curve is different. Now, there are many chicken processing plants in the counties in that hot spot zone. The state health officer said today the problem is not at the processing plants, but close quarters where many of those workers live. And that's where they managed to trace the outbreak of the virus back to where those people live. Live in downtown Jackson, Ross Adams, 16 WAPT News.